Hey guys and gals, it's not Dave, and I'm going to be not Let's Play Mega Man X. Yeah, it was a bit of a personal edition, and it's been way overdone. I mean, Perpetual Sense done it, it's pretty much, a, besides Perpetual Sense doing it, it's pretty much for new people. Always start with Mega Man X or some other Mega Man game, and I really don't feel comfortable doing it again, unless I'm going to be really badass. I mean, people have done boss challenges up the ass, there's even a uh, no-hit run by a shmup guru. So I really don't feel comfortable showing up how much I suck at it. Unless I get really good or I get really funny really fast, don't expect me to do Mega Man X. So in the meantime, we're going to do some other Mega Man fan games. I've had some other Mega Man games that i found that no one has let's played, and I do actually sort of like them. So firstly, I'm going to start with the Flash game. Yes, it's a Flash game if you haven't been able to tell by the uh, big play icon, which I'm pointing to even though you can't see me pointing. It's called Mega Man vs. Metroid. And it supplements Mega Man into the Metroid universe. Or rather, into Metro Samus's levels. I just like watching the loader. Watching all the robot masters running back and forth. If I ever do just talking videos, expect to see this again. <laughs> anyway, I can't just sit here and watch this all day, as much fun as that is. This is gonna I'm gonna explore everything. So there's an there's a branching route at one point. I will go back and stress my steps and Go to the other branching route. This game is made by Static Creator. Fantastic job he did. He coded, designed, ripped most of everything. He did a great job. And I'm going to explain how good of a job he did while I'm playing. Uh, let's go look at options. Options. We got change window size. I'm assuming that makes it bigger or smaller. We're not doing that because I have this set up recording. Music on and off. Change controls. Normally controls are the uh, directional keys and Z and X. Z and X should do shoot and jump. Respectively, I think. I don't know, they're backwards when you map it to Joy to Key, which was what I did. So let's just get into the game so I can start actually talking about it and playing it. Right out of Mega Man 2! I think it's Mega Man 2. Hey, this looks familiar. Why is there a score meter like in Mega Man 1? No one liked that game. Last time I played! Oh crap. Oh, anyways. Anyway, pause screen. We got options again. Change screen size, reset game. We also have room for some extra weapons. But that won't be important until we get farther into the game. So let's kill these boomers, and and I can demonstrate why I, th I think Static Creator did a fantastic job. Why is there a Okay, it's not glitch proof. Anyway, three shots. You can only fire three shots at a time, just like for Mega Man. We have a partial shot, fully charged shot, working slide, jump is excellent. As you can tell, the game is recoil. You might think it looks a bit floaty. That's because uh, we're in space, Dingus. And the game, besides using the Metroid tile, looks just like a Metroid game. And it feels just like a Metroid game, in my opinion. Sky Creator said he even took fucking notes on the game. No, I don't have a blaster. Whee! Oh, wait, I do. It's my arm. Hey, it's uh, boomers. I think I call everything in this game boomers. I don't know what they're called, but... As per car with, as per car with the Porsche, on a Metroid, you cannot kill them with normal shots, since Mega Man doesn't have any missiles. Charge shots do the job. This game seems to be becoming very generous with uh, the health items at the start here. Usually, it's pretty fair. It's not too often, but you'll get them when you need them. Weapons energy. I don't have any weapons yet, but weapons energy really useful when you actually have weapons to charge. Or rather, use. I'm climbing the corridor right now. And here's the first path if we continue upward. Fuck. I played this game three times in a row because I screwed up recording every time. I don't even need that. I don't know why I jumped for it. If we continue going up, there is another path. We'll be coming back to that path after we beat this level. But for now, we're going to continue on this path. So, doo -doo -doo. I have one can problem with these guys. They respawn too often, and they respawn if I'm standing above them. I don't think they do that normal Metroid. But then again, not a huge Metroid buff. I don't know the games in and out. I beat Zero Mission, I beat Fusion Mission, Fusion Mission. I beat Fusion just because they're so fucking linear. Because I, I get lost! I get lost in Metroid and Castlevania games. Like crazy. 
Like, I'm something retarded. I probably am if you've seen anything else, but let's continue on. We're heading towards uh, Norfair, I believe. I think. I think that's what it's called. Like I said, zero mission infusion, and then I wandered around in the original for a couple of hours without actually, like, accomplishing anything. Wow, that was incredibly generous. Well, oh, okay, that was something I should point out. When you kill a boomer, its energy appears above it on, a, on the platform. See the bounce? I don't, I'm pretty sure it's a normal Mega Man, but in this game it causes a glitch where it appears on the upside of stuff. Like that. You'll see that quite... Uh, I can't make that jump. Let's stop charging. Oh, right, I forgot to show some limitations. I'll show that right now since I have an en enemy. Any okay. Charge our shot. I'm holding the charge button. Take damage. My charge is gone. I'm still holding the button. And it's not my fault. Usually I let go of the charge button, but it wasn't me. That's a problem with the game. Okay. We charge our butt. Buster. Okay, apparently when we take damage, it doesn't recharge. Uh, pause game. Unpause game. My charge is gone. Turn left. Uh, pause game. Unpause game. I'm facing right. That's about the only limitations I have found... Any real problems with the game? There also, I believe there's a problem with the ladders. I remember reading when I first played this, but there are no ladders in the uh, Metroid level. I don't know if he got rid of them or that was in another, or I was just imagining it. But there are no ladders, so there's no worries about that. I hate those things. I forget what they're called. Not a Metroid man. No Metroid man. Fuck. Whee! And here we have the bridge to Norfair. Zoom. Didn't go far enough. No more fair, the stupid bubbly area. If we go up, continue. Shit. Uh, why is this taking so long? That's the other path. We'll be coming out of there after we fight the boss. Oh, excuse me, that was a burp. And I think we can fall mostly. Shit. Oh, crap. Okay, obviously, no secret there. I think in one of them there's a secret like that. Not here. Zoom! I don't know what this area is called, but we are going to be progressing through it fairly quickly because of crazy seahorse dragon thing down there. Eh, I made it through there pretty perilously. Usually I get stuck on the... Oh god! Seahorse thing spawning at the bottom. I get stuck. Ah, crap. I hate that thing. It always gets me, and I never think about to just run. I gotta get ah. Keep jumping, Mega Moon. So far, the controls haven't shit out on me. Usually, they'll uh, something will happen, and I it'll be like th pressing three keys at once and it'll lock up because it's a fucking flash game. Nothing there. If this was a real Metroid game, there'd be something there. Uh, shit, fuck. As you can see, lava does not kill; it just hurts. Zoom! And we're for another part of Norfair. Can't go up. So, only logical to go down. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck. Invincibility time is pretty good. I'm also really glad there's recoil. I've played really a lot of Flash games. There is no recoil when you get hit. And that really annoys me because I like to know when I've gotten taken damage. Because uh, when I suddenly look up and I have no health, that bothers me. Hey, look! Oh, fuck. <laughs> this looks like the Mother Brain area. And these little O things respawn. Nothing respawns in the game, because it's Flash. Unless it's a uh, constantly spawning enemy, like the uh, pipe monsters. The pipe bugs. Don't remember what they're called. Fuck. Fuck! Why do I keep doing that? That's what I keep wanting to do, but I don't do it. Let's... Damn it! Let's get to the end here. Then I'll spawn or spawn a farm. For hell, not good enough. My aim is just slightly off. Oh god! And no health. Or... Come on, I want health. You throwing all these things at me once. Throwing all these things at me once. I learned English. You be love you long time. <laughs> 